to our top story, the Magnificent Mile Lights Fest returns after a one year pandemic hiatus. Jenna Barnes is live along the Mag Mile with our story. Jenna, good evening. Hey, good evening to Mon and Jackie. The Mag Mile feels like the magic mile right now. The, the crowds have cleared out, but just a while ago, there were thousands and thousands of people packed in here, excited for this tradition, yes, but also excited just to get back together. Celebration drumming its way back to Michigan Avenue. Thousands of families lined the magnificent mile for the 30th annual Lights Festival Parade, making a comeback after a hiatus last year. It's wonderful. The Grand Marshals, Mickey and Minnie Mouse, illuminating more than a million lights here to shine through the holiday season, welcoming back the crowds. It's a, a freedom. Elizabeth Mathis is visiting from Austria, her first time seeing her family in the United States in two years. Very emotional for us to have them back after two years. And it's also special to have them here at the parade because we have been here every year since we moved to the U.S. And it's always a highlight and now sharing it with them is even more special. The atmosphere, the lightning, you know, the shopping, the, everything just turns so magic. Full of holiday spirit. If you were downtown tonight, you were likely in gridlock because of this parade. Dusable Lakeshore Drive was a parking lot for quite some time, but the good news here is the road closures associated with the parade, they've been reopened and it's a little easier to get around now. We're live on Michigan Avenue, Jenna Barnes, WGN News.